Welcome back to the channel, ladies and gentlemen. In this video, we're going to talk about the EIDL grant, and we're going to give an update on what's going on right now with the grant. And also, I'm going to give you some other grant options that could possibly help you out. So you definitely want to watch this video from start to finish. There's going to be a lot of valuable information in this video. And if you want to see more videos like this, make sure that you subscribe and hit that bell icon to receive notifications because I do upload videos frequently throughout the week, at least three times a week, about business credit, ways to make money online, and personal credit, as well as business grants. Also, if you want to learn how to grow your business online using the power of Facebook, make sure that you check out the link in the pinned comments that says get unlimited leads and sales for your business. This is going to help you get new customers for your business, no matter what type of business that you have. You're going to be able to get customers using Facebook. We teach you free methods as well as paid methods on Facebook to help you get fans as well as new subscribers to your email list and new customers for your business as you can see here we have some testimonials here for people who have used this blueprint and gotten results one person here has made over five thousand dollars in sales they did it before they even completed the training another person here fifteen hundred dollars so on and so forth so definitely click the link in the pinned comments if you want to learn how to grow your business online Okay, so first we want to talk about the EIDL grant. I'm going to give a little bit of an update. So they have not updated this website just yet to reflect the new bill that has passed. As you can see here, it still says EIDL advanced no longer available. So if you watch any other videos stating that they're going to release the new application on January 17th, that is actually not true because there is no information here stating that that is the actual release date. That is just information that has been floating around the internet and I wouldn't believe it because that did not come directly from the SBA. So if you actually click right here where it says apply for the loan, you're gonna see a notification here that says EIDL loan request only. If you are seeking to apply for new targeted EIDL grant or advanced grant, you're gonna have to click the link that's shown here to get more information so once you click on that link it's going to take you to this page and they actually don't have any information about the ten thousand dollar eidl advance grant there's actually no information here on this page so they have not completely finished updating the site and the new application is not available yet so we still have to wait until that information is released to the public. So don't believe anybody that's saying it will be released on January 17th because that is not official, that is not set in stone. And so if you click right here where it says COVID EID L and click on learn more, it's gonna take you directly back to that page that we just came from with the old information. So that's pretty much it for the EIDL update. There is really no updates. So everybody that's making videos about new updates, there is no updates, not yet. So I'm going to provide you with some extra information about some new grants that are available for businesses and individuals is going to be based up off of the requirements that I show you on each page, on each website is different for each grant. There should be something for everyone in this video so continue watching okay so the first grant is going to be provided by navs small business grant they do this quarterly the next round is going to be opening this month in january they're going to announce it here on this page so you definitely want to bookmark this page so that you can get the dates when they open up the new round so you're going to be able to get up to $10,000 for your business to take it to the next level. This is NAV's quarterly business grant contest. So they give out two different grants. One is going to be $10,000 and the other one is going to be $5,000. So in order to apply, you're going to have to provide either photos or videos to tell 
the judges why you think you deserve to win the grant. So that's just a little bit of information about NAV Small Business Grants. The link is going to be definitely in the description. The second grant is up to $5,000. This is for people who want to implement humanities projects that encourage public audiences to reflect on their values, explore new ideas, and engage with others in their community. All subjects and themes relevant to the community served are welcome. These grants aim to connect audiences more deeply to communicate where they live and work, solidify community partnerships, and diversify audiences. Also, creatively employ the tools of the humanities to respond to issues and ideas capturing the imagination of or and passion of New Yorkers today. So this is for people in New York who have a passion for the community. And you can register on this page with their grant team or you can email them and a link is going to be down in the description. The deadline for this one is April 1st, 2021. The projects will start in July. Okay, so this one is a small business grant, and this one is going to be for $5,000. So this is Save Small Businesses, a grant-making initiative to help small employers who are struggling during COVID. So in order to apply for this one, you will have to have at least three employees you have to be located in an economically vulnerable community and have been harmed financially by COVID. So what you're going to do is you're going to put in your zip code here to check if your business qualifies. And you will need to use the zip code that you use on your W-9 form. Okay, so they are providing grants for small businesses in all 50 states, including Washington, D.C. and Puerto Rico, those are going to be included in this. Okay, so here is a $25,000 grant for the United States and Canada. All you have to do is be able to provide a solution to help out during the COVID pandemic. The deadline is going to be January 30th, 2021. This is an article that you can read here. The link is going to be down in the description. You can apply on their website. You can also check out their other programs because they do have programs for Canadian students as well as, as well as American students, undergraduates, youth programs, and American scholars. So to apply for one of the programs, you're going to click on apply now. I'm going to be taken to this page where you can see all of their programs and you're just going to click on the one that is directed towards the COVID $25 or $25,000 grant. And you can also check out their other grants that they have here. Some of them are already closed. 